Hey guys, good morning. Um, the sun is just coming out and the birds are chirping, uh, so that makes me happy. It's another day we're alive and we get to glorify God and uh, use this earth uh, and just, you know, have a great day. Um, I wanted to talk today about something that's very personal to me um, and hopefully, you know, you guys uh, will like it. But I've been thinking a lot lately about, you know, my walk and my testimony and um, I share that with people. So I've been thinking about it and talking about it a lot um, and evaluating myself. But, um, you know, I spent, you know, it took me about 13 years to get here. It wasn't easy. It was hard. Um, I had a lot of ups and downs and uh, a lot of struggles. And I remember thinking uh, I've been a Christian at least for at least five of those years or six of them. Um and uh, I remember thinking, you know, I, I, part of my walk was I was always praying to God, you know, to lose weight, to be healthy, to show me different things. And of course he was along the way. Um, but I never understood why he just, um, why I couldn't lose weight. You know, he would give me great ideas. He gave me great ideas all the time and I would run with them and I would see something, some kind of little result. But I never had the full picture. He like, he... I never got everything all at once. It was little nuggets, little pieces. Uh, and of course it took me 13 years to get where I am right now. And I'm still, um, I'm not like, I'm not arrived. I still want to, uh, do better and, uh, and still improve in areas, but I definitely have the key now. Um, and I was thinking the other day just about it. And I was like, you know, as I was talking and giving other people advice, I was like, you know, why did God, you know, um, allow that to happen? Why did it have to take me 13 years to figure out things? Why couldn't I just have the the answer sooner? And um, we don't always get all the answers we want. We don't always have a, a clear definition of why things happen. But what I can tell you is that God has a plan. He has a plan for my life and he has a plan for your life. And as I am, you know, uh, as I've started this business and as I, you know, I have, you know, handfuls of clients, um, and I'm walking this walk with them, I'm realizing that the real reason, um, that God allowed it, you know, to take so long and, 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 and for it to take 13 years is because he wanted me to have all those pieces. This was his time, not my timing. He wanted me to have all those pieces so that I could better serve people. And as I'm, you know, as I have, you know, so many clients and I'm, I'm each one is different. They all have their unique personalities, their unique flaws, their unique uh, things that make them difficult or make them easy to work with. And, uh, and, uh, and they've all tried things and, you know, went through different things. And my testimony of 13 years doing this and all the different things I've tried and the ups and the downs, it is allowing me to be able to help them and to, uh, to relate to them in a way that is like, is so encouraging to me and so inspiring to me, but also to them. So it's like, God is using my pain. He's using my sorrows. He's using my, the 13 years of, you know, blood, sweat, and tears that I put into this. He's using it to empower other people, um, to get them where they want to go. So it's, it's just, it's amazing. You know, sometimes we just, I just, I want you guys to know if you're praying for something that, you know, to keep praying for it. Um, I'm also praying for a husband, uh, but you know, keep praying for it because God has a plan and he's going, he, he's always developing you. It's not that, you know, he wanted to, you know, wait to give me this, you know, this body or this health or whatever. He wanted to give it to me day one, but he had to develop me along the way and I wasn't ready. I had, I'm still in development. So, um, just because we're not reaching our goals or just because we're not getting that thing that we're praying for it doesn't mean God doesn't love you it doesn't mean he doesn't want you to have that thing and it doesn't mean that you're never going to have it it's just just means that you're in development stage right now like a you know a photograph that you had to wait for and uh yeah that's basically where we're at and I just I wanted to share that with you guys because I, it was so uh inspiring to me someone who used to lay in her bed at night and cry and 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 just kept praying God why can't I do this why can't I get there da, da, da. and now I finally understand it um I just know that when things happen in our lives we may not understand it 
We may lose people that are close to us. We may lose a job. We may lose, you know, a spouse, um, like divorce or something. Um, all different kinds of things happen to us, and we don't understand why they happen to us. And uh, But it's just, you know, it's encouraging just to know that God has a plan, and he knows why, and he's working everything out. Um, so just remember that, and uh, I hope this inspires you guys. It definitely inspires me, and I'm, I'm so happy just to understand what's going on right now. So uh, just thank you for allowing me to, uh, you know, share this video with you and to walk this walk with you. You guys have an awesome day.